Hi, I'm Maki Arai. Today we're at the Tokyo Rinkai Disaster Prevention Park in the Rinkai Fukutoshin area of Tokyo. It's a vast space where there's even a section for people to enjoy barbecue. The park was originally set up as a national disaster emergency response site. In the event of a major disaster, such as an earthquake, an emergency headquarters will be set up here, and it will also serve as a base camp for support teams, such as the self-defense forces and medical personnel. I'm at a place called Sona Area Tokyo inside the park. Hello. Nice to meet you. I'm Saba, the deputy director of the management center of the Tokyo Rinkai Disaster Prevention Park. Would you tell us about this facility? Sure. This facility is a place where information will be centralized in the event of a major disaster, such as an earthquake in the Tokyo metropolitan area. Aside from that, we offer a space where people can learn about what will happen when there is a big earthquake. So this time we'll be learning about how to protect yourself in the event of a major disaster. Mr. Sawa, what can you experience here? The Disaster Prevention Experience Zone on the first floor is where you can learn about how to spend the first three days after an earthquake. The first three days is a period when the national government and local authorities will be making preparations to provide support. You use the tablet to find out how to spend the first three days. Through quizzes and augmented reality, you can learn about the situation you'll face in a disaster. It's a tour to give people knowledge about how to survive. So this is what the tablet is for. Okay, let me give it a try. The scenario is that I go through an evacuation route inside a building and come outside. The city area looks very realistic. A city street has been recreated to show how Tokyo would look after an earthquake. It feels like something could fall on top of me at any moment. The tablet device is used in the area with the camera pointed at designated markers which will bring up important information to remember in the event of a disaster, as well as quizzes. Visitors answer the questions and learn as they walk around. Ooh. We've passed through the city area, and this looks like a gymnasium. I guess it's a recreation of an evacuation center. Yes, this is what an evacuation center will look like. You can use the tablet, and with AR, experience and learn about the situation you would face. And we have this tremor machine, so that visitors can experience what an earthquake would feel like. We want people to think about what to do in the event of a disaster. Please, give it a try. <gasps> okay. It's starting to shake. I can't keep my balance. Mr. Sawa, what is this space? Here, we show items that would be useful to have and that you should prepare beforehand in the event of an earthquake. And at a special section we've set up, we use projection mapping and graphs to show what kind of damage you likely see in more detail. Visitors can learn in detail about how to prepare against disasters, such as earthquakes, and see related equipment and models. It's important to be prepared for an earthquake and other major disasters. Absolutely. We really want people to experience our facility and acquire knowledge about how to survive disasters and prepare. Thank you so much for today. This time we brought you the program from Sona Area Tokyo, a facility where you can learn how to survive a big earthquake in the city. Hope you enjoyed it.